Step into the realm of prehistoric wonder as we unveil the captivating tale of the Archenosaurus. Prepare yourself, for this, is no ordinary dinosaur story. No, fellow dinosaur hearter, the Archenosaurus holds a special place in history as a real German dinosaur. Or at least, so it seemed. Allow me to shed light on this mysterious creature. 80 million years ago, during the late Cretaceous period, amidst a land veiled in ancient mysteries, the Archenosaurus roamed the earth. Its herbivorous nature lent a sense of gentleness to this remarkable genus. Fossilized remains, buried deep beneath the German soil, patiently waited to be discovered, their secrets yearning to be unveiled. In 1887, fate conspired to bring forth a discovery that would forever etch the name of Gerard Smets into the annals of paleontology. With deft hands and an insatiable curiosity, Smets unearthed these ancient relics near the German city of Aachen. Little did he know that his findings would ignite a scientific debate that would echo through time. Smets, a paleontologist, soon recognized the Archenosaurus as a proud member of the renowned Hadrosaur family, commonly known as the Duckbill dinosaurs. With meticulous care, he pieced together the fragments, envisioning a creature that once roamed the primordial landscapes. Imagine a relatively diminutive hadrosaur, stretching about 5 meters in length and weighing a mighty 1,000 kilograms. A true marvel of nature. Like its relatives, the Archenosaurus boasted a distinguishing feature, a flattened and elongated snout that mirrored the graceful curves of a duck's beak. This characteristic, so wonderfully preserved in the fossilized remains, painted a vivid picture of the creature's existence and left Smets awestruck. However, brace yourself for a twist in this tale of brilliance. For you see, the Archenosaurus held a secret, a secret that would cast doubt upon its very existence. It all began when the eminent paleontologist Louis Dollo crossed paths with the mysterious fragments. In a stroke of realization, Dollo shattered the illusion that Smets had so carefully constructed. What Smets believed to be the lower jaw of a dinosaur turned out to be nothing more than petrified wood. A relic of an ancient forest, frozen in time. Smets could not accept this revelation. Consumed by his unwavering belief, he waged a bitter campaign to tarnish Dollo's reputation. In a desperate bid to prove his initial claim, Smet summoned to other esteemed paleontologists to investigate the fragments. Their conclusion aligned with Dolo's, delivering a devastating blow to Smet's aspirations. Defeated and disheartened, Smet's retreated from the public eye, his dreams of immortalizing the Archenosaurus forever shattered. And sir, we must face the harsh truth. The Archenosaurus, much to our dismay, does not exist. As we bid farewell to the illusory Archenosaurus, let us continue our exploration of the boundless wonders that paleontology unveils. Please like and subscribe if you heart dinosaurs as much as we do, as it helps us to grow our channel, and you don't miss our next video. See you.